Good morning guys. Welcome back to the Packer Scrapper. Gonna start off with a pickup this morning. Got a little bit of everything it looks like. <sighs> Two year old birthday parties. They don't get no better than that. Sometimes, you know, the little ones are scared. Me and my dog, my granddaughter. <laughs> she just eating it up the attention. So much, in fact, she made us relight the candles and so she could blow them out again. <laughs> Alright, now let's see if we can lift this up here. Why not start the morning out big, huh? Nice and clean. Three stoves? No, washing machine. And two stoves.
That's it. That's it. It does help to have all the right tools. That is for sure. Strap her up, head to the yard. Moving on. All right, do us a little non-Ferris Jeff here. Good morning. Already warm. I know, I'm already wet. We got Junk Man 5000 back there. <laughs> You're wet. Exactly. That one's definitely dirty. <laughs> Clean or dirty? Clean? Which, I think that's it. Where do you want to put that? There.
We'll stack high. Scrap Jenga. <laughs> I thought I was about done. Yeah. Just set them there. That's gonna weigh no matter what, right? Yep. Yeah, that'll do it for now. We'll go dump this other stuff. 36. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, moving on. All right, let's go see Jill get weighed in and go get rid of this. Oh. Ah. 97.80. What's up, little guy? You better move along. You're going to be ending up there in a pile. Thank you. You're welcome. Moving on. Alright. See if we can get this unloaded. quick thank you <laughs> bye see you later moving on still working on that pile 
Good morning. It's like Groundhog Day. Huh? It's like Groundhog Day. It's hot out here. <laughs> Every day it's hot. Five hundred and eighty pounds of tin, fifty-six clean and aluminum, and forty-six irony light. That was seventy-six dollars for one pickup. It's a good way to start the day. All right, I got three more pickups, then we'll head out and do some scouring. Moving on. Heading back to the house because I forgot something. Look what we find. Our first grill of the day. Boop, boop. So I think we're up to number 10. Grill number 10. trash can put all the little stuff in what you got somebody's already cut the cord so I'll cut the rest of it <laughs> all right moving on another stove At least this one doesn't have any glass I can break out. sitting there underneath the mattress first I didn't see all right stop home got my notebook got me a freezer pop actually with electrolytes in it she is going to be a hot one all right moving on and if we have to do it on the first one too, let's grill up some likes. Hit that like button. Grill number 11. up all the chimney pieces fireplace Whew, just like that filling her up moving on all right 9800 we were driving by the yard anyways to get to the other place so might as well dump it and start fresh all right catch it here. Here I'm loading.
Moving on. 9160. Alright, one more pickup and then I can hit the streets. We're not gonna cash this one out. We're gonna wait till we get the next load. Batman, yes, ma'am. I really need somebody to turn the AC on, man. Okay, I'll try to cool it off for you. <laughs> I'll blow. <laughs> Have a good one. <laughs> Moving on. I'm at a private pickup. Just took a break. It says nine. It's 98 degrees. Real feels 126 degrees. That's crazy. 98 feels like 114. And reads 100 right now. So when I get that bad, just take a break. Get in the car, cool down, ice down, get the heart rate back down. No rush. Ooh, moving on 9980 so we picked up a bunch of Christmas trees uh, a little bit of the metal and there's some engine in here somewhere <sighs> film the unload all right let's see if we can get the unload here come on in. So the first load was 640 pounds, second load 580 pounds. So 1120 with that, the two loads. Right around $85. Alright, got a couple more pickups. It's 12 o'clock. Car says 98. That's what the thermometer or the gauge in here says. So moving on. Alright, so we just went and seen our AC guy. Got an AC and a handler. There. Whew. And we'll take a bike. There's no way you are. 
Yep. Use metal. Alright, I'm gonna go around and see what we can find laying around. Moving on. Well, this ain't big and bulky, is it? Wow. That's tough for you to come off there. Huh, maybe not. So tough. There we go. Less likely to for the wind to take her. You're not gonna come off, are you? Nope. At least it'll be down far enough that I shouldn't grab it. Moving on. And he's able to stop in some shade. Mm. Yeah. Racer. That's aluminum. Get a fridge, I'm gonna be in trouble. Wouldn't plan that out very well, was I? <sighs> Set that heat does to me. I'll just have to shuffle everything back. As long as it's in the shade, we're good. Moving on. Add us another microwave. Which we could use to cook up some likes if you haven't done that already. Go ahead and hit that like button. And while you're at it, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. <sighs> Moving on. Looks like we got some more exercise equipment. I don't think you two are you part of it? Nope. Get rid of the pieces. Hopefully this thing rolls.
see if we can get you up in there somehow. Just like that. All right, moving on. Just don't know if I can take the glass. Those are metal. Plastic? I think that's plastic. Sorry, can't take that. <sighs> I gotta see how I'm gonna get that bad boy up in there. <sighs> uh, always the fun, huh? Always the fun. What's life without a little adventure? Keep her interesting. Hey, how's it going? Well, I asked your card, or I would have called you directly. Hey, no worries. I'll give you a hand. Still. I don't know if that's going to lift by that or. Where are you going? Just. Yep. Set it right in there. Nope. Yep. It's all good. You have a card? Yes, sir. I'm having some uh, kitchen work done, so I might have oh. more appliances. Oh. Okay. Definitely, definitely. Ready. I'll just give you a call. I'll hold them in the garage till you're in the area. So. Yeah, I'll be here every Tuesday. So. Right, appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks for the help too. I was wondering how I was going to get it up there. <laughs> Moving on. This is not what I needed. Those things are so flimsy. Let's see if we can strap them in here. Might be able to get both up there. out of this guy's way and find a place to shade and tie that down moving on yeah, they're not getting any smaller are they
Moving on. Another shed. Thing is, this one's not aluminum. fit in there well, I am 61 years old and I have never had a summer like this where it's this hot I mean I've had hot before but this is nuts First pickup, I had to stop and get in the AC for a minute. I know I'm out of shape, but it's getting better. Getting better. Might have to head to the yard and dump this.
Thank you, Jeff. I think we was 10.5. We are now 96.60. So, should be close to 900 pounds, I think. All right, battery's going to die, so I need to replace it before I go see Jeff. Moving on. Thank you. Surviving. Irony light. That's clean. I think that's clean with that piece is clean. Oh, these go as irony light, right? Yeah. Pots, pots and pans? Two more. Two more. Two more. Four more. Five more. Found some stoves today. Time for a nice cold drink. Huh? Yes, sir. Oh my gosh. All right, I might cut these cords. It's terrible out there. Oh yeah. At least you got some shade here. For, for a little while. Yeah, I've got to load my trailer. Well, the process is doing Right, you don't get to stay in here, but. Are you wired today? <laughs> no, you're just saying that until that, right? I'm just getting this, the big ones out. They're taking up too much room. I'm running out of strength. You're a married man, Kevin, that's why. Exactly. No nacho today. What's that? No nacho today. He was out there before lunch. Yeah, he didn't make it up here, but he said he had to do the same thing that I had to do today. Yeah, he teaches at middle school. Oh, yep. Yeah. Uh, My grandkids are going to that. I just got back. Yeah. yeah. How was it? Lots of people. Lots of time. Yeah, moving on. Okay, 860 pounds of tin, 42 irony light, two clean aluminum, six extrusion, 18 insulated copper wire, 
208 cast iron motor. So $124. 1011. A little over 1100 pounds. <sighs> We're gonna head out a little bit more. Karen was nice enough and gave me a freezer pop, so that really helps. Moving on. All right, so I went to Plants Guy. Got a fridge. And one, two, three, four, five, six dishwashers. And then I just stopped and got the fridge and the grill. Mark that grill down. I think that's number 11. And hit them likes if you haven't done it. All right, I'm heading to the yard before it's five o'clock. It's 4.30. Uh, I need to get me one of them things that air conditioning things that go around your neck and blow mist up <sighs> Somebody says they're not bad So I'm gonna have to look into that All right moving on All right, so it's right at five o'clock our yards closed. So we're gonna run to Titusville real quick I gotta dump this off. I got a business account to pick up tomorrow morning. And I wanna do that first thing in the morning before it gets too hot. So, probably won't film over there because just like our yard, they wanna close and go home. So, they're gonna be in a hurry. So, I'm gonna dump it quick and they'll come back and tell you what I got. It's two refrigerators, seven dishwashers, and a grill. That's what I'll be dumping off. All right, guys, let's see. We have, I'm gonna have to add these up 192 clean iron, 168, 156, 338. So, three, five, six, eight hundred, almost 900 pounds. Uh, low grade motor, and I got rid of that AC unit. Uh, it was aluminum. So, we got 82.63 out of that. And now I'm calling it a day. I am done. It's 5.30. Heading home. Moving on. All right, guys. 7.30. Back home. Showered. Cleaned up. What a day. I was not planning on working that long. But that's what happens when somebody calls you. And they got, what was it, six or seven dishwashers and a fridge. And I went and picked up another fridge and that guy gave me a grill, which I'm not sure if I added to the grill count or not. So I'm gonna have to watch the tape here and put it out. I think we're setting at 11, could be 12. So I'll put it on the tape which way it is. So we started out this morning, two pickups, and then ran to the yard real quick. Our first pickup and then ran to the yard and then went and got two more pickups, ran to the yard. And you know, it's so long, I don't remember what I did. <laughs> anyway, we finished with 4,170 pounds. What a heck of a day. Um, uh, I'm so beat right now, I can't even think. Well, if you're new to my channel, that's one thing I need you to do. Tell me where you're from, what city, what state. Or what city and country and I'll put you on my map and if you got time and you would send me a postcard and we'll attach it to the map to where you're from all right I think that's gonna do it if you liked riding along please hit that like button and if you haven't already please subscribe it helps us you know, I, looking at my thing, my, they send you stats and stuff. 60% of the people who watch my videos are not subscribed. So how do I get them to subscribe? That's the question. Get them to push that button. Well, guys, got a corporate pickup tomorrow. That's why I had to run to Titusville tonight to dump that last load. Our yard closed at 5. They closed at 5.30, and I barely made it. So I'm ready for tomorrow. Plus, I went out to my son-in-law's. He had some oil I got to take to the business I'm going to. Used oil. So they recycle that. And then I got to do a, the corporate pickup at the business. 
I might film that tomorrow. As long as I'm not in that area, I'll show you what I'm doing. All right, guys, till tomorrow. Moving on.